Like I thought. Manager, 
if they fall. Recharged! You're just in time, my dear Lachance. Wind of my heart sail has been captured. It's that thieving pirate lord, long bronzed Gilbert. I aim to run him through with a rusty cutlass, but alas, where's <laughs> the most potent protection? The chances plot armor. After Gilbert sweet talked his way onto our boat last night, he stole a chance away and vanished. Must have been using that sea sorcery that's so popular here on the island. Go talk with the local witch doctor. We'll have to fight fire with fire. Plot armor is precious booty. No man can die when wearing it, so the legends go. But somehow, Gilbert pried the armor off my chance. Unless he... No, he had to have used some magic devilry. The witch doctor's an old friend. Her magic's helped me out of many a sea pickle. Which is like a sea cucumber, but even brinier. Excuse me? Um, Hale, are you the witch doctor? No, Cauldron. I need a drink. That be she, but she be asleep. Or in a trance. Or a sleep trance. Find a way to wake her from her witchy slumbers. Up you go! Well, blow me down! That trance be deeper than a sunken semiotation! But have no fear, there's a cannon not far that you might commandeer. Shoot a course!
Welcome to Yes We Cannon, here for all your cannon <coughs> needs. If you need something louder, we've got the powder. Uh, care to give it a blast, me lord? Oh, very quaint, don't you agree, me lordy? Yes, but I'm looking for less quaint and more thunderous. You understand? Oh, you just sorry shots! The Lordy wants it louder! Bring her down below and swap her up with something what picks proper! Let's show him what the Far Mountain Clan can do! At the ready! This will not do. Only the loudest cannon will suffice. If possible, I need it to be too loud. Is that clear? But the Dragon Cannon is forbidden. Ever since it woke the dragons of the far mountain in the last age. Splendid. Step to it, lad. Very well. Dragon cannon. Dragon cannon hoist! Right, you dogs. Right. Please hoy that elder boar from which all worldly sorrows were shot. Today, we rouse the hells themselves. That's exciting. Put your butts and do it, you sorry spineless assassin! Don't keep the customer waiting all day! Just a moment more, I'm sure. Pull her up faster! The Lord is dying all age up here! I am so sorry, me lordy. The earth is... My goodness, that was loud. Oh, what's so bloody important that I couldn't get a little shut eye? A brigand needs to face justice, but he wears plot armor. Can it be destroyed? Destroy plot armor? Impossible! Unless you're a cunning witch doctor like myself. I can't destroy it per se, but. The curse of true character could turn a crusty coward into a smaller creature, and the armor would fall right off. Well, then again, they might transform into a vicious giant monster, uh, depending on their character. Either or. I must have misheard you. I, I thought you said transform into a giant monster. Tell you what, meet me at the ravenous caverns and we Put the curse together! Together! It's a good thing you arrived when you did. A coven of coils showed up at my hut the other day, claiming my magic cauldron for their own. We'll reclaim it soon, but we need the proper ingredients first. Sea hags! Comrades and concubines of Long Bronze Gilbert they are! Bones! So it's you who wants to destroy some plot armor. <laughs> Didn't Lachance own some? I thought you two were flotsam bound together in a foamy sea of love. I we are now and always will be. But the chance has been kidnapped, and his plot armor sits on the burly chest of Long Bronze Gilbert. I won't rest till my love is in my arms and my blade in Gilbert's gut. will harvest the materials for the curse in this hex caster. Now we'll
will need to collect curse essence from some sorry cursed souls. Head to the grave of the bone-picked pirate.